Hello friends, welcome to Nandkishore classes. Today we are going to learn division of decimals. In our last lecture, we had covered multiplication of decimal numbers. Now division of decimals is very easy topic, but usually students face problem in that. That's why we have selected this topic. See, let's suppose you want to divide 2.4 with 0.2. I'm going to clarify this concept with very basic method and I'm sure that if you learn with this method students will never forget it see first of all what we need to do just remove the decimals don't do anything just remove the decimals after removing decimal we will get 24 by 10 to be divided by 2 over 10 because once we remove the decimal after decimal only one digit is coming that is why only one zero will be placed that means it becomes 10 now it is just a division of fractions now you just need to remove division sign and place multiplication sign instead of division and do the reciprocal of the upcoming term next term like 2 over 10 becomes 10 over 2 see these are the basic steps behind it without cramming anything just follow all the steps see 10 and 10 are cancelled because they both comes in the table of 10 then 2 times 1 is 2 and 2 times 12 is 24 and your final answer of this question will be 12 I hope you are finding it easy let me give one another example let's suppose we have 0 0.36 to be divided by 0 0.4 let's suppose we need to divide these two terms what we are going to do 0 0.36 you can write it as 36 over 100 now I have placed 100 because after decimal two digits are there so obviously two zeros will come then divided by 0 0.4 can be written as 4 over 10 Following the same procedure in each and every question, we will get 36 over 100. Sign of division change into multiplication and 4 upon 10 becomes 10 upon 4. Ultimately, what is going to happen in the table of 4, 36 can be cancelled. At the table of, in the table of 4, it comes at 9. 1, 0 is also cancelled. We are left with 9 upon 10. 9 upon 10 means 0. 9 is going to be the answer for this question exactly same method we are using I am going to take one more example so that your concept is completely clear let me take another example let's suppose we want to divide 0 0.48 okay 0 0.48 to be divided by 0 0.0 0, 4. Let's suppose you want to divide these. Same process we are going to follow. 0 0.48 can be written as 48 upon 100. Right? Then sign of division. 0 0.004 can be written as 4 upon 1000. Okay. Now, following the same procedure as decided. Change the sign of division to multiplication and it will be 1000 upon 4 now. Right? Now cancel 4 with 48. You will get 12. Two zeros are cancelled. I am left with 12 times 10. 12 multiplied 10 means 120. See, division becomes very easy when you follow the basic process. Usually what students try to do, they try to learn about how to shift the decimal, how to place the decimal without doing these steps. And believe me, after some time when they don't use this concept, they forget it. That is why I have tried in this video to clarify the basic concept behind it. So that anytime whenever this calculation is used, they can do it. Right? And I hope this calculation is clear to all. In case if you still face any problem or you have any questions, you can write in the comment box. 
But if you like the video, then I request you all to please share it as well. Thank you so much.